Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. Once again, thank you so much for supporting me here at my own thing, you guys. Really appreciate it. And I've been having uh, the time of my life making these videos for you. Uh, we're going to do a Gear Thursday video right now, and it's another one of my potent pairings where I take two pieces of gear, put them together, and to get some tone. So this pairing is going to be my 2015 Les Paul Standard that I bought used on Reverb.com. And the Nobles Overdrive pedal, their ODR1, which is a, a pedal that got popular in Nashville first. I first learned about it from my friend Tim Pierce. He actually gave me this one, so thank you, Tim Pierce. Check him out, always. And so I'm putting these two things together. Now, I've got the Les Paul. It's going through an 11 watt uh, divided by 13 CJ11, uh, which is very similar to like a Fender Tweed amp. Uh, you can get very similar tones to like a, maybe like a Champ or something like that. Um, also, I'm using the middle selection for this potent pairings. Uh, middle selector, turning the front pickup down about two numbers, uh, turning the bridge tone down a couple of numbers. Even, even them out, even them out. So right now we've got that setting on, on that configuration on the Les Paul into an 11 watt tube amp for a clean tone like this. Now we want to add the nobles, the settings. I have very basic, I, you know, basically the drive and spectrum pretty much at 12 o'clock and then the level just enough higher to make it sound like a lead tone. So when I put that on with this clean tone, Like that. I like this pedal a lot. You know, if Tim Pierce uh, recommends it, you really can't go wrong. And you can find them now everywhere. Reverb.com. Check them out uh, for the Nobles Overdrive. Love the sound of it. It's very warm and uh, gives you that, that kind of sag compression feeling. So what I'm going to do for this specific lead tone is I'm going to add one other little, just little sprinkling color here, a little seasoning, if you will, and it's the timeline delay, but you can use any kind of digital delay for about a one and a half repeat. So that's without it, that's just with reverb, but here's the delay with the one and a half repeat. So it's very subtle when you're playing, you shouldn't really hear the echoes that much, it just should add uh, body. <laughs> yeah, that's a good word. You really, you really only hear it when you stop a note. Right, so now that's the potent pairing, the Nobles and the Les Paul. A little sprinkling of delay and then I have a little loop here so we can hear the lead tone over some uh, some rhythm so let's see what we got